Hello everyone, welcome to the series of data analysis using Excel. This is Dr. Atman Shah. In this video, I'm going to describe how to perform one-way ANOVA using Excel. You can find more videos on SPSS, RStudio, Econometrics, Mathematical Economics and Economics on my YouTube channel. So don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon. Let's begin with the idea of one-way ANOVA. One-way ANOVA is used to compare the mean of two or more independent groups. So here you can see I have four independent groups. Students from arts stream, commerce, science and management. And I have the hypothetical data of 15 students and their marks. So therefore, we can use one way ANOVA. Now how to frame the a uh, null hypothesis in this case. The null hypothesis says that there is no significant difference in mean of independent groups. An alternative hypothesis that uh, says that we have the significant difference. So in this case, we can write the null hypothesis as no significant difference in mean marks of arts, commerce, science and management students against the alternative hypothesis of the significant difference in mean marks. Now let's see how to perform it. So uh, you go to data. In data, we have the option of data analysis. Once you click on data analysis, this, this dialog box will open. And here you have the option of ANOVA single factor. ANOVA single factor. Simply click on OK. So now we need to select the input range. So select the range. Group by columns is selected by default. So we don't need to change because we entered the data column wise. You can see. If you enter the data row wise, you can select rows, select labels in first row because name of the variables is written in output options, select output range, select the cell by default alpha is 0 0.05. So simply click on OK. So here we have the result. So F statistic is here, it is 0 0.12413 and associated p-value is 0 0.945. Now this p-value is higher than 0 0.05, this p-value is higher than 0 0.05 and therefore we fail to reject H0. Now, since we fail to reject H0, we conclude that there is no significant difference. No significant difference in the mean marks of arts, commerce, science and management students. So, this is the idea of one way ANOVA. If you find this video useful, kindly like, share, comment and subscribe. Thank you.